Mumbai winning it, Ajita Agarkar taking it to the last over. Did the better team win over 40 overs? Yeah, I mean, you'd have to say that. But, uh, you know, that drop chance of uh, Nitish Rana uh, probably cost uh, or made, made uh, life a lot easier for Mumbai. Again, Rohit Sharma, you know, in spite of not being as fluent as he normally is, uh, was there till the end to finish things off and pull out another cameo. So, but mm. Nitish Rana, again, an impressive guy, keeps uh, impressing with every every game and uh, you can see his uh, number in the batting order keeps climbing so good signs for Mumbai. Yeah well runs for Nitish Rana, runs for Kyron Paula, Rohit Sharma so every everything slowly get coming into place for uh, Mumbai. Gujarat on the other hand Brad Hogg and we've been saying it from game one some of Suresh Raina's decision making uh, no Aaron Finch today because of a bizarre misplacement of his kit. I wonder if these two ever lost a kit and therefore lost out on a place in a team. Uh, then Jason Roy who doesn't bat uh, until number 6, Ishan Kishan getting a go at 4. And then some of the bowling choices. What's going on Bradley? Well, I don't know what's going on. I'm not in the camp, am I? But uh, Roy uh, getting picked in front of Finch because of a, a, a kit mishap. I, I don't know what's happening down there, but it's cost them a catch anyway. So he's out there. So that's, that's, that's done some damage there. But then you, you bat Roy after his opening, uh, been opening the first couple of games, you bat him after Kishan. I don't mm. know why Kishan's coming in out four when you've got Kartik and Roy there. Mm. Surely you'd leave Kishan down the order and let these uh, other players, more experienced players, get out there and get the runs on the board because it is a tough wicket out there to, mm. to go out and start as we saw today. So that, that's probably the difference is batting Kishan out four. Um, and it, Tampai, Tampa, I thought he could have bowled a bit more to mm. Karen Pollard when Pollard came back in. You need pace against Pollard early on. Um, you saw Patel hit him in the gloves early on. And um, yeah, that short ball, that's the one that troubles Pollard. But Patel hits him in the gloves yep. and then bowls two slower balls, gets hit for six in those slower balls. Mm. What are you thinking about? Get it around the chest area of Karen Pollard. He doesn't like it there. Outpace. Mm. 